Attention, the following video is totally going to kick ass. If you enjoy any of it or have a large <laughs> please click the sub and like button below. Enjoy. Being healthy. Or the win. Sonic is my this way is to swag, This is an intro. Hey YouTube, SDH4 here, and today I'm going to be reacting to a new SML called SML Movie, Jeffy the Lawyer. We see, we saw Jeffy as the judge one day, one time, and now we're here with Jeffy as a lawyer. A lawyer. Is he going to use his brains to help an innocent, um, uh, help, uh, uh, a suspect, um, innocent? Who knows? Anyways, I hope you enjoy the reaction video. Watch the original video first. Subscribe to SML. Subscribe to my channel down below. Hit that like button. Ring that bell notification. Without further ado, we're going to get started. Three, two, one. Let's go. I get the last Oreo. No, I get the last Oreo. Dibs. No, I get it. I my house. Get it. I don't <laughs> my parents might be getting divorced, and I've already heard enough yelling today. I don't care. Uh, I want the I want Oreo. The They're getting Oreo. divorced. Oreo. Why? What's going on here? Well, Jeffy, there's only one Oreo left, and I believe it belongs to me because it's my house and they're my Oreos. No, it doesn't, dude. I'm the guest. I should get the last Oreo. Well, in my opinion, why don't you guys cut it in half and then you each get a piece? <gasps> Ooh. Wait, that would be fair. We would both get half the Oreo. Dude, how did you come up with that? Whoa, Jeffy, you're a genius. You should be a lawyer. Really? Yeah, you should take the bar lawyer. exam and become a lawyer. What's the bar exam? It's a test that you take to become a lawyer, as previously implied. Oh. Okay, I think I'll do that. Yeah, Jeff, you'll be a really good lawyer. All right, Joseph, let's split this Oreo. Yeah, let's do uh, it, dude. Hey, don't, don't, don't. Sorry, you'll get in it. <laughs> wow. You can't cut it in threes. You can't cut it in threes. I mean, you can. It's possible. Florida State Bar Exam. In order to be a lawyer, you have to pass the bar exam. So I have a bunch of candy bars laid out here in front of you, and you have to smell each one and then correctly identify it. Because a lawyer needs to have a good sense of smell. Like, you have to be able to smell if somebody's guilty or not. Like you smell uh, how could he smell with that pencil in his nose? Smell that. Hershey's. Oh, very good. Of course. How about this? Snickers. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, like wow. Smell, but let's try this one. Twitch. Okay, okay, that's good. <laughs> what about this? Finger on my butt. Oh no, butterfly. You oh, almost almost got you there. That's disgusting. Okay, that's good. Wow. Now this one, this one's good a job. Um, what you call it? Well, okay, that's it. You passed the bar exam. Congratulations. Nah, yay! Yay! Hey, Daddy, I'm a lawyer now. I passed the bar exam. But Jeffy, you're too young to drink. What? No, Jeffy, you can't be a lawyer. There's no way you passed the bar exam. Well, I did. No, I not that kind of kind bar, bar exam. Bar. Guessed him correctly. Yeah, your son's a lawyer now. But Jeffy's not smart enough to be a lawyer. Well, he's the first person I've ever met to actually pass the bar exam without even studying. It took me three times. It was that damn whatchamacallit. It just smells like... He just loves candy so much. become a lawyer? Because I want to help people and make a lot of money? Yeah, lawyers get paid, bro. No one's gonna hire you to be a lawyer, Jeffy. No one's gonna trust you. Well, people have actually been blowing up his phone all day. They saw that commercial he made. What, a commercial? Yeah, look. Hey there! Been in a car accident? Someone shooing you? <laughs> boo boo? We'll call Babu Bop Bop and Babu. I don't get what unless you do. So call us right now. Babu Bop. What the heck? Babu. This message was approved by Jeffy. Babu Bap Bap Babu. Babu Bap The babu, freak? Babu. Attorneys at law, daddy. That's ridiculous. No one's gonna hire you. Well, I actually hired him for my restraining order case later today. A actually, you know what, Jeffy? You have a case coming up. You better get to it. All right. All right, daddy. I'll see you later. Oh, I'm so proud of Jeffy being a big boy lawyer. Aww. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Poober. And today we will be hearing the case of Jackie Chu, whose Jackie Chu restaurant is in danger of being shut down by the health inspector. Why? It seems that he has been cooking cat and dog and serving it to people as food. Ew. Mr. Health Inspector, what have you witnessed in his Chinese restaurant? I witnessed them taking cats and dogs out of cages, cooking them, and then serving them as orange chicken. Good. Jeez. Lord, Mr. Chu, these are very serious and gross accusations. What do you have to say about this? Yeah. I do serve cat and dog, but it's delicious. Wow, you just admitted it. Just like that. Okay, well, does your lawyer have anything to say to help you get out of this situation? Yes, Your Honor. My client does serve cat and dog. But my question to you... 
Have you ever tried it? God, no. Cats and dogs are so cute and cuddly. I would never eat them. Never. Your Honor, there's a huh. shame. Don't knock it till you try it. And yeah. You try it before Let's you send it to Jeffy. You make a good point. I've never tried it, so I guess I don't actually know what it tastes like. I suppose I can have one piece. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's slow mo. Oh, <laughs> the slow motion's real. I haven't seen anything like that before in an oh, SNL video. This is the greatest thing I've ever eaten. <laughs> Slop, use your fork. Don't talk in your mouth, for bro. Health inspector, you are fired and no longer allowed to inspect food. Ouch. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jeffy. Thank you so much for saving my family's restaurant. Babu, bap, bap, babu. Nice. Whoa. You get all this moo moo guap guap. I won my first case today, day, and he was bing bong as fuck. What, Jeff, you actually won a case? Marvin, he passed his bar exam. He knows what he's doing. Yeah, sure do, day. And I got another case to get ready for, so let me go ahead and break you off a piece of this bread right here. Give you a few bread come, cause you know I gotta hook you up cause you my daddy. All right, here, yeah, that's good. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable George Boomer, and today we will be hearing the case of Brooklyn Guy, who wants to file a restraining order against his brother Jonathan for trying to hook up with his wife. Brooklyn Guy. Oh my Tell god, this! So, my brother Jonathan is a 30 year old virgin who still lives with our mom, and he's always hitting on my wife and trying to bang her, so I just want to get a restraining order so he can't come near me or my wife. Very Dang. understandable. Jonathan, is any of this true? Well, Brooklyn guy is just jealous because his wife thinks I'm a total hunk. She's always staring at me up <laughs> and a glimpse of my meat whistle. Like, damn, lady, I'm a human too. I have feelings. God damn. I'm just a piece of eye candy you get to suck on. See, my client is a victim. It's true. Oh, bullshit, Your Honor. Jonathan's lying. No woman is attracted to him. Order, order, order. Everybody settle down. Karen, do you feel like you're in danger of Jonathan? Like maybe he's stalking you or trying to do things to you? Well, he does say a lot of weird things. Yes, you're really. Right. She feels afraid. I see. Well, Jonathan, I have no choice but to grant the restraining order, unless your lawyer would like to say anything about this. Case. Yeah. Oh, 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 sorry, Your Honor. I got a booger on my nose. It's a deep booger. Come here, booger. Get out of my nose. No, oh, no. He said booger three times. Hey, Brooklyn guy! It's me! Oh, it's no! scary friend, booger! Yeah, I know, booger. Go away. I'm in court. Ooh, did you do something bad, huh? Huh? Did you get a DUI? No. Did you rob a bank? No. Did you kill someone? I'm gonna kill you if you don't go away. Whoa, that's a threat. Oh, Brooklyn guy, you don't mean that. Shut the hell up, booger. <laughs> Mr. Guy, who are you talking to? He's being no, delusional. Oh, come on, Brooklyn guy. You don't want to tell about your best pal, booger? Of me. Yes. Oh, come on! I'm like your hype man. I'm always there saying, you the man, Brooklyn guy. No. Freaking man. I know, booger. And then if anyone ever says you're not the man, I say they're wrong, because you the man. Shut you up. But that's the judge. You want me to go mess with him? No, please don't. I'm going to go mess with him. I don't no, think you can no. touch Mr. him. Mr. Guy, who the hell are you talking to? Are there voices in your head talking to you? Your Honor, Brooklyn Guy is clearly insane. He's not mentally stable and he's making false claims of Jonathan stalking his wife. I am mentally stable. Booger, get away from the judge. Stop trying to give him a wet willy. Mr. Guy, who the hell are you talking to? Are there voices in your head speaking to you? <laughs> wet willy, Booger. Yes, Your Honor, there is a very annoying ass voice who really needs to shut the hell up. Hey, Brooklyn guy, did you see what I did to that judge? Oh my I gosh. Yeah, I saw it, booger. Oh, did you like it? Was it funny? Shut the hell up. Oh, that's not very nice, Brooklyn He's delusional. I'll kill you. I have heard enough. Mr. Guy, you are clearly mentally unwell, so I will not be granting <laughs> your restraining order. I will, however, be admitting you to a mental health facility immediately. What? No! You just dupe yourself. Oh, you think I serve pizza there? My favorite's pepperoni. Shut the fuck up, booger! Oh, <laughs> 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 Justice is served! And now 
now with Yuckling Guy gone, Karen will be all alone for me to try to bang her. Ew. Thank you, Jeffy. You're the best lawyer ever. Babu, bap, bap, babu. Ooh, damn, look, I just got back from Kansas. Whoa. Beef chickens I got. Holy crap. Want another case. Jeffy, thank you for my new purse. And thanks for my arm manny sunglasses. Sure thing, daddy. Yeah, here go another 10 piece for tomorrow. Yeah. Here you go, mommy. You can have you a 10 piece too. No sauce on that bit. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jeffy. Keep winning cases. I'm gonna go shopping. Nice. Order, order, order. I'm the Honorable Judge Pooh and today we will be hearing the case of Tyrone and Judith. Judith wants a divorce from Tyrone. Oh, Cody's, Cody's parents. Judith, let's hear your side of the story. Well, Your Honor, Tyrone just keeps cheating on me over and over again with so many women. I just want to be done. Hmm. Tyrone, what do you have to say? Now listen, everybody owns more than one pair of shoes. You don't just wear the same pair every day. That's me with pussy. I want the house and everything. No, ho, I pay all the bills. You can have the boy. I don't want the boy. I want the house. Order, order. Jeez. Uh, okay, it sounds like the divorce is settled. It is happening. But now we need to figure out who gets the house and all of the assets. Jeffy, what do you think? I think that you take a chainsaw, you cut the house in half, and everything they own in half, so it's 50-50. Hmm, that's fair. I like it. I grant you both 50-50 of everything. Cut everything in half with a chainsaw. The boy too. What? Fucking what? Hell, I'll get the chainsaw. I'll hold the oh, board. hell no. Nah. Babu, babu, babu. Beep, beep, beep. It's Amazon. Jeez. Got another package for you. Shine right here, Daddy. Shimmy. Daddy, Shimmy. That's what me and Grimlock do so, uh, all the time. Beep. Mommy, is that jacket made out of Antarctic polar bear puss? It was shaved. It wasn't tortured. Okay, well, I got another case. Your friend Goodman hit a kid with his Lamborghini, so I got to go try to save him. The kid? No. Oh, baby. Let's put it in the safe. <laughs> order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Boomer, and today we will be hearing the Jeez. case of Mr. Goodman, who is being accused of running over a child in his Good Lamborghini man. and driving away. The mother saw the Lamborghini hit him, so mother, tell us what happened. <laughs> My boy was drawing with his chalk in the road, and this rich guy in a Lamborghini ran him over, and he didn't even try to stop. Mr. Goodman, is this awful accusation true? You didn't even try to stop? Well, Your Honor, I was being <laughs> roadhead from this 10 out of 10 baddie. I was in a throat trance, so I wasn't even paying attention while I was driving. Hmm, so you were distracted while driving and killed a little boy. Yeah. Oh, like you're guilty, unless your lawyer can get you out of this mess. Well, Your Honor, to be fair, you weren't fucking there. You didn't see what happened, and neither did I. The boy's mom could be lying. She probably wasn't even there. So how can you judge what happened if you weren't there? Hmm, that's true. I wasn't there. Everything could be a lie. Well, if a tree falls in the woods and no one's around to hear it, does it Jeez. Hmm, I suppose it doesn't. Mr. Goodman, you are not guilty of vehicular manslaughter. Jeez. What? No! He killed my little boy! This is not justice! Jeez. Oh God, I'm going to celebrate by getting more roadhead. Thank you, Jeffy. Babu, bap, bap, babu. Marvin, your son's a genius. He won. Wow! I got sucked off on the way here. I'm gonna get sucked off on the way home. Mr. Goodman, do they have any mouthwash? Get back in the car, chinchilla. Okay. That's a lot of money. For your house payment this month. It doesn't matter. Jeffy, print money. He a money print machine. Beep. Well, buddy, I actually don't want to be a lawyer anymore. What, what do you mean, Jeffy? I did not like it. What do you mean you don't like it? I don't wow. Like it. You don't like making cash green guap cash green guapo? I don't like it. Marvin, if Jeffy doesn't want to be a lawyer, he doesn't have He's to be a lawyer. He's got enough money now. Put the cash in the green in the beep. Marvin, we had enough. <sighs> babu bap bap babu. At least he didn't lose all that money. Well, uh, I'm a PT, so there's that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the reaction video of SML. I'll see y'all later. Peace. Stay healthy for the win!